cards. You know some rules we don't use here. Shall we play a game with Balam's rules and ours? Uh, sure. Open same trade rule one. Okay. Yeah, let's not do same. I don't like same. The open rule has spread throughout this region. Okay, that's nice. Please, please, this way, sir. Oh, we're gonna use that voice for him now. Uh oh. What? Raiders? Okay. That's a random train that. Nope. So, so you guys are seeds? Oh, this is the guy looking for. <clears throat> Magazines, huh? <laughs> I'm the squad leader, Squall. This is Zell and Selfie. Nice to meet you. I'm the leader of the four Star Wars. Don't shake hands, dude. <laughs> nice to meet you. And. <laughs> so let's get on with it. What do we do? Oh, Zell. Just take it easy. You know what I mean? Introduce you. Looks like you already met what? I guess it's just our princess then. Princess. It's the princess's nap time, sir. Oh, man. Hey, Squall. Sorry, but could you go get a princess? She's in the last room up those stairs. Some of our other guys are in the room on the way. Ask them if you get lost. <laughs> uh... Will we hire the red parents? Well? <laughs> uh, are you angry? We're not gophers, we're sea special forces. This is the last time for this kind of thing. Oh. And he has a stomach again. Ouch, my stomach. Getting for the. Oh. Do you play cards? No. Do you play cards? No. Do you play cards? Uh, I'll, I'll try seeing. I don't like same, but let's see how it goes. What is this? Uh, we need a bomb. Uh, Marlboro. So we've covered bottom right, top left, bottom left, top right. Yeah, there you go. This is so anime. I love it. Oh. Uh, top right is this. Well, that kind of sucks. So we just go top left, top right. Oh, what the? Oh, so that's how it works. Okay, one and six. Uh, wow. Huh. Well, I guess we're gonna do this. That was close. Um, let's get the visage. There we go. Do you have anything special? Not really though. Uh huh. You can do this. And uh, we can do that. Oh, you're gonna flip. Nope. Ooh, well, we could do this. Can't beat me. Alright, uh, Hexagon. Alright, let's move on. Uh, let's go find a princess. Wherever she is. Squall, way to go, you tell them. They can't treat us that way. 
These guys don't seem to have it together. <laughs> yup. Uh, oh, okay. Oh. Our princess is in the room further down. What are you gonna wait, your princess? You've got some guts, man. Sound. The train moving. It's so relaxing. Would you like to play some cards? Nope. Alright. Oh, back here. Huh. Nothing, I guess. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, that's it. Uh, doors open? Wait. Aww. Uh, hey, you're, you know, from party. So, does that mean you're a seed? I'm squad or squad leader. There's two others with me. Hey! Yay! You see this here? Ooh. Nice. Take it easy. It's just that I'm so happy. Ah. I've been sending requests to Garden Forever, but nothing. I'm so glad I spoke to Sid directly. Oh. So you're looking for the headmaster at the party? Oh. So that's who she ran off with. That's a very nice model, though. Uh, no. You know Cypher? Uh, yeah. Oh, he's the one who introduced me to Sid. Okay. Sid is such a nice man. Okay. I really didn't think Sid would come out to help a measly little group of guy like us. But after explaining our situation to him, Sid gave the go-ahead right away. Now that you guys are here, we'll be able to carry out all kinds of plans. Okay. That's a very princessy kind of room, but that's a terrible looking bed. You wanna play cards? Yes? I'm going back to the others. Okay, let's go. Oh! Uh, Squall, is he here? E? Cypher, no! He flunked the test. Yeah, he's not a seed. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, my name's Minoa! Very pleased to meet you, Squall. He shakes her hand. Okay. Seed members dance quite well, don't they? Approach your target inconspicuously at a dance party. There may be emissions requiring, requiring this kind of subterfuge. It's expected of Seed to learn various skills. Oh, so it's work related. Huh, that's too bad. Oh, doggy! Hey, Angelo. Yeah, let me introduce you. This is my partner, Angelo. There you go. Angelo's really smart. Here, let me tell you. Ah, her limit break uses Angelo. Tricks Angelo can learn are less than understand the screen. The fourth status screen lists all the tricks that Angelo can learn. Okay. The gauge on the right indicates how much has been learned. When the gauge is full, the trick has been learned. Well, okay. If the, gauge is, if the gauge is not full, the trick has yet to be learned. <laughs> to learn a new trick, move the cursor to the trick name and press. Oh, we don't need this. Okay. Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, it levels by her walking around, so that's not really what you want to do. I have some important work to do now. Be good, Angelo. Oh. Okay, I'll meet you there. Uh. Wow. <laughs> the doggy's like. Oh. Is she in. Oh, she is in a party. Alright, okay, so. <sighs> yeah, beyond Angelo, Rush, and Cannon. You don't really want to learn anything else. The only trick you should be learning is Full Moon, if I'm not mistaken. It's the best. So these two... Yeah, we're gonna skip. We'll learn anything? Okay, that's fine. I do need to know where to find Full Moon though.
sorry. <laughs> I had to do that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm Hello? Oh, we've reached our destination. That's why we came to a sudden stop. Of course, there's nothing wrong with this train. I'm the one who's taking care of it. Strat meeting, by the way. You're really lucky to come away without a scratch. Uh, okay. But why not pat it? I couldn't! Hey, Sharp Tie. How you doing, man? Okay. Can we play cards, please? Oh, he fell asleep. <laughs> do, 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 do. Hey! Do, 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 do. Squall. Well, oh, this is Zell. Is this selfie? Hi, everyone. <laughs> this way. Do, 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 do. Okay. Miss Goosh? Just then where just then any Whoa okay. Anyway you want, sure. This is a full skill operation. Our resistance to forest owls will be forever known in the pages of Timber's Independence. It's exciting, huh? It all started when we got a hold of top secret information from Galbadia. I got an info, sir! There's a VIP from Galbadia coming to Timber. Super VIP! The guy's name is Vinza Dalling, our arch enemy and the president of Galbadia. Vinza Dalling is a scoundrel. He's a dictator, not a president. Not even popular in Galbadia, sir. What's the. What's. Uh, Zell, what you doing? President Dalling is taking a private train from the Galbadian capital. Our plan is to. Oh. Blow it to smithereens with a rocket launcher? Uh, 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 not, not quite. So get to the point. Just tell us what you want to do. Shall we begin? First, I'll go over the model. Okay. The little train on the top right is our base. We're running it right now. Next to it is a dummy car. We made it look, made it to look like just like the president's car. Okay. The train has three cars. At first, there's a locomotive, followed by the first escort. The red car is the president's car. Darling should be inside. The last car is the second escort. Once we get on this one, we begin the operation. Our ultimate goal is to seize the president in his car using our base. That means we have to switch our dummy car with the president's car. We will use the two switch points leading up to Timber to carry out this operation. Okay, now I'm going to explain the procedures in seven steps. Oh my god. Seven. Number one. Sneak on board the second escort. We'll get on the roof of the second escort by jumping from our dummy car. Oh, right. By jumping. By jumping. Proceed cautiously across the roof of the second escort. The second escort car is the only one that is equipped with sensors, sir. A high tech officer is on board. I'll talk about the sensors later. Alright. Proceed along the roof of the president's car. We can move across the roof of the president's car without worrying too much. Dalling hates the company of his guards and being surrounded by sensors and keeps them away from his car. Okay. Uncouple the first escort car. We'll have to complete the uncoupling before the first switch point. If we don't, boom. Game over, right? Yeah. So we have to move fast. I'll explain the uncoupling process later. Have the dummy car and our base move in after an, after uncoupling. After the car is uncoupled, we'll have the dummy car and our base move in. Okay. At this point, our train and their train will be linked and be moving together. Okay. Bing. Uncouple the second escort car. This is the last uncoupling. The process will probably be similar to the first one. Escape with the president's car and our base. Nice. If all goes well, we should be able to escape with the president's car. After that, we'll return to our base and prepare to confront Delhi. Alright, we have exactly 5 minutes to complete the 7 procedures. If we fail, our train will collide with theirs at a switch point and it'll be all over. Don't forget that. 5 minutes? You sure that's enough? According to the simulation we ran, it should only take 3 minutes to complete the operation. Piece of cake for seeds, right? Gosh, too easy! Uh, okay. 
Okay, let's talk about how to avoid the sensors on the second escort. Go ahead, Watts. The guards have a sound sensor and a temperature sensor, sir. Any sound will trigger the sound sensor, so move across very quietly, sir. The blue guard is carrying the sensor. The temperature sensor will go off if you remain stationary, sir. The guard in red is carrying this one. When the guard opens the blind, that means he is checking the sensor, so be careful. The range of this sensor, the range of these sensors is equal to the length of one window, so keep an eye on the window below, sir. So how exactly do you avoid them? Stop if there's a blue guard below you, run if there's a red guard below you. There you go. Run or stop depending on which guard is below you. There you go. That's about it for the sensors. Now let's talk about how to uncouple the escort's car. Question! How can you uncouple the cars from a moving train? Um, we can't uncouple the cars directly. Instead, we'll have to tamper with the control system that manages the coupling. If we temporarily disable the circuit for the connection, the car will uncouple automatically. To disable it, we have to enter servo codes. And we have the codes. We know what has them, sir. I'll be in charge of relaying the, the codes to Squall. Squall, you slide down the side of the train using a cable and enter the codes to the, the system. Now, I, lead I need you to listen carefully. Each code is, oh my god, 1, 2, 3, 4. Numbers between 1 to 4, it has 4 digits, 2, 3, 1, 4 is an example. 1, 2, 3, 4, starting on the right, okay. But the keypad won't have numbers, instead it'll have 4 buttons. For instance, if I relay the code 3, 1, 2, 4, you have to push the buttons in that order. You have to be quick and precise, you have about 5 seconds to enter each code. Oh man. Otherwise the code will change and the past entries will become invalid. So like we said, we have to answer all the codes to disable the connections. After we uncouple the cars, we'll wait for the others to operate the rail switch. Remember, we only have 5 minutes to do everything, so make sure that you're prepared. Okay, let's try practicing entering the code. Enter 3 codes and you'll be finished. If you want to quit, hold down left mouse button. Uh, left button, not left. Alright, let's try this. One, one, four, three, one. Nice. Okay. Three, okay. Three, one, one, four. Okay. Four, 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 one, four. Hey, there we go. Got it. And the real thing, there's a strict time limit leading up to the switch point. Don't forget that. Uh, that's all. By the way, this model's nice, but the president's car looks kind of shabby. Why is that? Yeah, we know what made it. That's why we bought everything else at the gift store. <laughs> oh, I thought it was. I thought some kid made it. The paint job sucks too. Uh, uh it kind of does. Oh, shut up! I made it look like that on purpose. It represents my hatred towards Stelling. Hatred, eh? Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> it's one of the. Ugliest things that I've ever seen in my life. You must really hate him. <laughs> Are you guys finished? Enough about the model. Can we get on with it now? Whoops. Do you understand? Yes. Let's decide on the party. Gather me information is my specialty, sir. Bye. Oh, my stomach. <laughs> ah. Moving again. I'll go take a look. Talk to Watts when you're ready. Alright, the sooner the better. Alright, so this is zone, right? Yep. It's a clipping for the magazine. Read it. Anarchist Monthly. First issue. Galbada's dictator, President Vincent Dalling special. How does he stay in power? We reveal his darker secrets. Uh okay. Is it a oh, it's the second issue. President Dalin became the president after the Second Sorcerer's War ended. To gain support quickly, he carried out an invasion of Timber. It was only a ploy to decorate an already corrupt man's immoral career. Our land Timber was brutally destroyed. Here began Vincent Dalin's road to dictatorship. The third one? Oh, it is! To imprison anti-government sympathizers, the D District Prison was built in the desert south of Dalin City. Millions were spent to build a facility. The threat of being sent to the prison intensified Dalling's unpopularity. The prison began imprisoning Galbadin anti-government sympathizers just as they did in Tim. Excuse me. Moreover, the leaders of the resistance movement 
faced the threat of having family members in prison as well. Around this time, Deling began surrounding himself only with loyalists, which turned him into an even more fierce dictator. Final issue. With the exception of Astar, the Galbadian military possesses the world's only long-range missiles. Although never used in combat, their existence has become a worldwide threat. threat. It is said that the missiles have the ability to hit any target with astounding accuracy even without using radio signals. Will the time come for the president to push the button? When the, come to, when the time comes to... Uh, the print on this blood on it. Damn it. Is it the last? Oh, it is the last one. Oh, jeez. Don't read it. We're done. Nope. Alright, let's save. Let's save. There we go. Wait, what? What? I'm in a bad mood right now. If there's nothing in particular, I order you to leave immediately. It definitely looks real, huh? No one will ever realize that it's a fake. Okay. Have you seen the dummy of the president, sir? If you haven't, please take a look, see. It's like a piece of art. I know the kidnapping plan must be tough, but best of luck to you, sir. Are you ready? Yeah. Hey, squad over here. Oh. Did I change my squad? We'll catch up with the second escort soon. Let's get ready. We should time our jumps well after we catch up to them to save some time. From now, we have exactly five minutes to complete the operation. Let's try to use every second. Yay! A to jump. Okay. A, X, Y. Okay. Over here. Oh. Sound, let's not move. Uh, okay. What the hell? <laughs> They're just talking. In the president's car, after we, had a, after we get across, we'll proceed with the first uncoupling. Okay. Sir, everything is in order, sir. You again. That's 27 times now. How many more times do you plan to disturb me with that meaningless report? I'm sorry, I'm very sorry, sir, but it is my duty, sir. Uh, it's hard to believe that anyone will put up with this nonsense. I guess it's not about business. This missed. Sir, yes, sir. There goes my next month's paycheck. How am, I gonna, how am I gonna propose to her now? I'm gonna have to put it off again. Oh man. Well, that sucks. This is the first ascot. Ascot, ascot, ascot. We're gonna cover this first, alright? Like what said, there should be two guards on this car. So if it's Zell, you guys keep an eye on the guards. Let us know early if you see them coming. Alright, I'll watch the blue guard. I'll take red, alright? When it's closer, it's going to want to keep an eye on them too. Hold LB to look to your left and release it to go back. Are you ready to enter the codes? Yeah. Okay, three codes are going to couple this. Okay, we're ready. The system is to enter the code. It's down there. You can't miss it. Press down to go down. Alright. Come back up, press up. You won't be able to come up when you're entering the code, so be careful. Alright, let's do it. Four minutes left, let's go. Okay. One. Uh, up, 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 up. And red. Uh. Okay. 
four, one, two, three. There we go. Let's go, let's wait. All right. Run. Oh, that's nice. I do it. I know he's not gonna like it, but it's my job. This is sir. Everything is in order, sir. Huh? He's not angry. Ew, that's strange. Always reading the paper. Wanna wake got it? What? Is there a problem? I'm in a bad mood right now. There's nothing in particular. I order you to leave immediately. Uh, so, sir. Aye, aye, yes, sir. <laughs> you don't understand it. Get back to your station. So yes sir. There goes another paycheck. It's two in one day. Oh man, that's terrible. No, what the heck? Is this the right train? Uh, the interior looks different. It looks shabbier. Maybe not. Oh, it's close. What am I gonna do? No ring and now no more candlelight dinner. I'm never ever gonna be able to get married. Aww. All right. Second last car after this, we're home free. You know, two guys on this car too. Okay. So I don't watch the right side do hold on I'll be. Uh I'll be Oh yeah. Five codes. Are you ready? Yeah. Well, it's three, four, two, three. Three, four, two, two. Okay. Two, four, two, one. Yep, we're gonna go up. Okay. Three, one, three. Two, one, four, two. Come on. One, three, four, three. There we go. Let's go this way. All right. Whee. Oh. That's a nice mini game. Hmm. There we go. Pretty neat. Finally, we've waited so long for this encounter with Vincent. Was that perfect, sir? Amazing, sir. You're the best, sir. See you, America, by what? When, uh, well, then. Leave the intelligence up to me, sir. <laughs> and here's a stomach. There we go. Ah. <sighs> You three, tell me when you're ready to go. As soon as you're ready, I'll begin serious negotiations with the president. Serious negotiations. Better make sure my GF's equipped. Why would it not be equipped? Oh! Hey, what? Uh... Shiva? Okay. 